everybody, it's Diane. Um, well, I noticed that my diamonds are gone. So I do have now less than 10,000 diamonds. Um, so that means that the diamonds were distributed. I guess gave away 4,650 diamonds to 31 lucky players who uh, responded in my uh, second uh, anniversary of uh, MSM on YouTube. So congratulations to the winners. So check out your islands. Your diamonds should be in your game today. There will be no ad or announcement of that. You'll just, the diamonds, 150 diamonds will just have appeared in your game. So this is my plant island and I am going to do a video showing you how I um, create my globes designs, particularly this one, <clears throat> the I Heart MSM. So here's the I Heart MSM. Basically what I'm doing, so let's just start with the, the letter I. Can you see when the lights go out, it forms that I right there. Okay. So I'm going to just tap on one of the globes that's part of the eye. Okay. So we have um, 16 choices of lights in our sequence. Um, so what I did was I dedicated three to each letter or each symbol that I was doing. So the first three, uh, first three, uh, were, uh, this is the letter I. So I wanted to make sure that the three lights are out for the letter I. So the next three, top three, are the heart. <clears throat> the heart I did one light out, one light on, two lights out. Um, because I have 16 uh, choices of lights on or off, um, I dedicated three to the I four to the heart, three to the M, and then three to the S, and three to the M. So that's what you'll see here. So here's three for the I. So every time I look at one of the globes for the letter I, you're going to see there are three lights out. Okay, so then the next set of three is the heart. So let's look at um, the heart. So this globe is part of the heart, and here's the heart. One light, one light out, <clears throat> one light on, one or two lights out. That's what's making the heart flash, like it's beating, beating heart. So this particular globe that I've got right there is not involved in the other letters. That's why you see just that part that way. <clears throat> So basically, if you're just thinking of one letter at a time, you can go in and do the I. Whatever, wherever you want to put the I, just focus on changing those three. And then, um, so here's an M. Okay, here's a globe that's in the M. So anywhere there's an M, I have the three out here, and I have the M because I have M, S, M. So here's the M, three, this would be the S, so when I look at the S globes, they'll be all out right here. And here's the second M. So we've got basically up here, we've got the I, heart, M, S, M. And I chose to have the lights out, so I could do any color and all the letters would be the same color. They'd be dark for lack of being lit up. So that's the I, heart, M, S, M. I did basically the same thing on Earth Island, except the globes are lit up instead of, um, you know, turned off. The I is slightly different, but it's the pretty much the basic, same basic uh, letter pattern, um, except I only have globes on the island uh, that I need for the letters. So you'll see spaces, like right here, there's spaces, no globes here, and no globes here, because they... I didn't need them as part of the letters that I was creating. So this is a good way to put the same message up without having so many globes because they can really be time consuming when you have to spend two hours for every single globe to um, conjure. So this is the same pattern except for the lights are on. So let's look at the lights. 
So the light sequence is three on because that's part of the letter I. And here's the four for the beating heart. And here's, because um, this letter is part of the um, um, M also, it's on here for the M and it's also part of the M here. Does that make sense? I hope so. I hope I'm explaining this well. Um, so, so try not to confuse yourself, just try and work on one letter at a time. But um, so the, these are the globes for the I heart MSM. And this is how I set them up. You can do them, of course, in any color, any arrangement. And you can write any message you want. Um, just remember you've got 16 globes to work with and that number has to be divided by the number of letters that you're uh, making. Um, so I did create a special uh, picture, which I did post on Twitter. I'll just go to my Twitter real quick here. and So if you have Twitter and you want to snag this grid, this island floor plan, I will also put the same um, picture on as my uh, cover on the video here. <clears throat> so this is the basic floor plan for most of the islands. It may vary slightly for uh, the Sugarbush Island, but it's pretty accurate for most of the islands. So you can um, just print this or uh, put it into your uh, device and draw on it to create letters anywhere you want uh, in your um, island plan. You know, of course, you know, moving your monsters accordingly to get them out of the way. <laughs> so, um, Anyway, so I will be announcing a contest, so you'll stay tuned for that. This weekend I will be announcing a contest to um, inspire or to encourage you to create some cool globes um, pattern designs. So here's one that I just kind of created uh, using this uh, grid. I'm sorry, it just takes a moment just to open up here. Ever since I put my photos in the i in the cloud, they they take a while to open up. But ooh, do do, we have nothing but time, right? <laughs> so okay, so there's the um, the floor plan that I just showed you with some of the letters. Um, the M is slightly different, but it's just because that's oh <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's pretty funny. Okay. Because I created this as a PNG, if I place this on white, you would see the the lettering. Um, <laughs> that's funny how it disappeared. But uh, so these letters are slightly different. Um, the M and the heart are slightly different, but just play with it. Print that uh, floor plan and create d designs or letters. And then if you want them to flash in sequence, just remember, you know, sequencing this one first, this one second, this one third, and dividing it between the 16 uh, bulbs you have. So, all right, that's it for now. Have lots of fun playing globes. Stay tuned this weekend for the details on my contest, and I will talk to you guys soon. See ya!